We open the week with a celebration of Chinese New Year. Let's end the week with a celebration of Chinese New Year, this time in the kitchen. So get your apron or just your appetite ready as Couple Buy in LA starts right now. Magandang Bernes ng hapon po mga kababayan. Nako, walong taon na po ako dito sa Amerika. At sa walong taon, kada taon, pag Chinese New Year, naghahanap po ako ng tikoy. Hanggang ngayon, wala pa rin pa po akong makita. Napakahirap hanapin. But let's admit it guys, when we talk about Chinese New Year, we think of food. And when we think of Chinese food or Asian food, what's one of the first things that comes to mind? Very easy, very accessible, very affordable, and very flavorful. Panda Express. And we are in the kitchen. We're bringing you Panda Express today on Kababai in LA with Adrian and Chef Joe. Hello and welcome Hello. to Kababai in LA. Kong Hei Fat Choi. Choi. Thank you very much for having us. You know, I keep hearing Kong Hei Fat Choi and Sin Yin Kwai La. What does that mean? Do you know the meaning? Happy Kong New Year. Happy New Year. Kong yes. Hei Fat Choi. Happy New Year. We started the week with a Chinese New Year celebration and we'll end with a good meal because we are going to talk about... Chinese New Year and fire firecracker chicken. chicken. So it's our very exciting dish that we bring back for Chinese New Year. Yes. Let's talk about Chinese New Year. Chinese New Year, I hear, is the uh, most important celebration in the Chinese calendar, in the Chinese culture. Why is that? Well, it really represents a time for new beginnings. So it's a time where families can get together and feast on good food as well as wish, wish each other good luck and prosperity for the new year. Now, I heard that this year, Chinese New Year fell on Monday, January 23rd, but the celebration continues? Yes, so Chinese New Year uh, runs on the lunar calendar. So it's actually, it did start this past Monday, but it's a 15-day festival, and a 15-day so, celebration. Wow, 15 days, that's a lot. When we talk about celebrating for 15 days, what do Chinese families do? A lot How do of you eating. celebrate? <laughs> a, lot, a lot of eating. And then I hear that you also give like red envelope, you give candies, you have fresh flowers in the house. What is that all about? Yeah, so traditionally uh, married couples will give red envelopes mm -hmm. uh, with money wishing uh, single and young people good luck. Oh, I need to have one of those then. <laughs> and Chef Joe, a lot of eating that means a lot of cooking correct definitely and that is your role today on the show because you are going to prepare a firecracker chicken yes what does it have what do we need so we're gonna cook firecracker chicken today um, the first ingredient of course the marinated chicken breast and we have crisp um, bell pepper as well onion and we're gonna toast all together with the zesty firecracker sauce. Yes, I was hoping to get the um, the recipe for the zesty firecracker sauce, but it's a secret. <laughs> it is a secret recipe, so Janelle, if you want some, you're going to have to come to Panda Express. I know, but that's not the only thing, right? What is the Panda Express doing to celebrate Chinese New Year? Well, we have this promotional dish here, so really, uh, Panda Express, we cater to all parties. So for Chinese New Year, you're welcome to get catering for your families. All right, it smells so good in here. I think it's because of the sauce and the chicken very healthy, only what, 240 calories because it's yes. chicken breast? So Go firecracker ahead. chicken, it's considered one of our wok smart dishes. Oh. What that means, it's less than 250 calories per serving. So it's not only tasty, but it's good for you as well. Go ahead, Chef uh, Joe, uh, prepare the dish for us because I cannot wait to eat. But while you're doing that, why is this called firecracker uh, chicken? So typically, traditionally, for Chinese New Year, a tradition is to light firecrackers. Mm -hmm. And we light firecrackers to ward off evil spirits and to bring in good luck. Mm -hmm. So we have in our dish right here uh, chili peppers that represent firecrackers. So it does give it a fiery kick. Mm -hmm. The dish is spicy. But we don't use any gunpowder to add spice. Right. To it. Oh, I hope not. <laughs> but then uh, the the chili pepper, I like that because when you eat it, it actually bursts uh, flavor. It bursts uh, the flavor bursts inside your mouth. Yeah, so right? there is a lot of great flavor in this dish. Right. Uh, we cook everything fresh in our restaurants. All our vegetables are prepared fresh daily. Mm -hmm. So we have uh, Joe's putting in here as he's preparing uh, ginger and garlic crushed red chili pepper, onions, 
all really to bring out flavor in the dish. Right. It's not only bringing out the flavor, it's also bringing out the smell. The smell alone na ko. Amoy pa lang po, nakakabusog na. Kaya we're gonna, uh, we're gonna pause for a few reminders. When we return on Cabo Bay in LA, we are going to try the firecracker chicken. Be ready.